Mobile mapping. Hmm? What is it? Well, that's what we're going to talk about in this video. So if you've been watching some of my videos on this channel or the PQS Tech channel, where I've been putting out secret little videos, yes, link down below in the description, you'll know that I've been talking about digital construction and what is happening in the industry right now and what the future looks like. We've touched on things like laser scanning for surveying. We've talked about point clouds. We've talked about drone surveying. And now we're going to talk about mobile mapping. So firstly, let's get into what mobile mapping is very briefly because it can be overwhelming and technically quite boring. Mobile mapping is using lots of sensors and technologies such as GPS, LiDAR and cameras. Now we've talked about laser scanning and we've talked about point clouds and point cloud creation and we've also talked about drone surveying and photogrammetry. So mobile mapping for me sits at the top of the tree. It is the all singing dancing hardware that allows you to map using photogrammetry a construction site or any project that's going on. So technically mobile mapping is collecting geospatial data using things like phones, cameras, lasers, LIDAR, <sighs> the list can be endless. And it's essentially using on hardware that can be put on a vehicle or on a person and you walk the job or you travel the job and that collects the data for you. You're collecting data about the physical world, including the measurements of 3D objects and topographical information. Okay, so let's talk about hardware. You may have already seen on a previous video that I've done that the closest thing to kind of mobile mapping that we've used has been the Navis VLX. So the Navis is a wearable technology that you walk around and it takes photos at intervals and that's used as photogrammetry to create point clouds and 3D orbit views and mesh models. Now the Navis, whilst I've only used it briefly or seen somebody use it briefly, is great but you have to be physically wearing it. So the next step up from the Navis is a hardware that can be mounted onto a vehicle. The advantages of mounting this type of hardware on a vehicle means that you can map long stretches of any project and wherever you can drive you can map. So that's pretty awesome. Here's an example, we did a job in Leeds and it was a ring road for a client and the ring road, if it was to be surveyed traditionally, so taking points on the channel line, the center line and the channel line, plus your curb line, plus all the other features, you probably have to shut that road down because it's too dangerous to put any kind of surveyor on the job whilst there's cars going up and down. If you were to do it traditionally, uh, you would be looking at probably a three day survey then plus all the processing and it would be a 2D drawing, which is to be honest nowadays, pretty old hat. So doing some mobile mapping with Trimble and thanks to Corec who helped and sorted us out with this job, we were able to map the ring road in around about 10 to 15 minutes mind-blowing. So let's jump into it and have a look and see exactly what it produced. Right, so hopefully that's given you a really good insight into mobile mapping and exactly what you can get out of it. I'm currently working with PQS Tech, the sponsor of this video, and we are going into mobile mapping in a big way. Why? Because it is the future of construction. And I'm really excited to say out of all the products that we've looked at in the market, you know, using your mobile phone to map, using, like I say, the Navis, using Trimble. There are other products out there like Leica. We are looking at those, but I am so excited because I think we've found the best solution that, you know, bridges the gap in the market right now between hardware that is wearable and hardware that can be put on a car and something that can do everything. Stay tuned because that will all be exposed real soon. Okay, enough of the teasing. If you like this video and want to learn more about mobile mapping, please go ahead and write a comment down below and subscribe to the channel. <sighs> Digital construction is getting excited. And the way that it can help engineers, surveyors, tradesmen, it's mind blowing. Keep an eye out for new technologies coming forward. It's exciting. I'm excited to share them. Hit that subscribe button. I'll be back soon with another video.